Hi. I normally travel around London with a Freedom Pass because I've got a disability in my left leg um, of unequal leg lengths due to end stage arthritis in my left hip and I find it a lot easier to walk with a crutch. However, on New Year's Eve, when I decided to visit um, Westminster to see in the New Year, I was a victim of a pickpocket. They got my bank card and my Freedom Pass, and I think I was also trying to get my phone, but I was unsuccessful with that. Um, I reported the matter to the Metropolitan Police on New Year's Day online, as well as cancelling my bank cards with my bank. I've done that via the app on my phone, and I also phoned Freedom Pass office up. They were there on New Year's Day, and I reported the loss. However, I had a bit of a rigmarole getting a new pass issued. By Friday the 7th of Jan, I had not had a crime reference number from the Metropolitan Police. I phoned them up on 101 and I spoke to a total of three different people. They couldn't find any um, report on their system. And then what the last person said, hang on, this happened at Embankment Underground Station. I said, yes. And they said, you need to be re going to the British Transport Police because this would have been referred to them. And I got a crime reference number for them. However, when I put this to the Freedom Pass people, they said it wasn't valid. It wasn't a crime reference number. Okay, there may have been a mistake by the um, British Transport Police, but I phoned them up, double checked. No, it was it was the correct crime reference number. Went back to um, Freedom Pass. Still wouldn't accept it. So I made a third phone call to British Transport Police and asked them to email the um, crime reference number to me. And I phoned the Freedom Pass people up and I emailed it over to them. Um, they were still trying to say it was an incident number and not a crime reference number. But I emailed it and I thought, you know, okay, they won't be able to argue with that. However, on Saturday, 8th of January, I got an email to say they couldn't find my records. Oh dear, what do we do now? I immediately um, got photos off my phone of the Freedom Pass and sent them back in to them. And this morning on 10th of January, they said they had found my records and they could now get me a new Freedom Pass issued. And it's due within the next five to ten working days. Hopefully, the sooner the better. But all that pissing about took two and a quarter hours of phone calls. And then all that buggering about with emails. If there's one lesson, if you do ever get anything stolen or lost on the London Underground or any railway in London, do not report it to the Metropolitan Police. Um, report it straight to the British Transport Police for one reason. You'll, it will save you a lot of time, effort and energy in phone calls trying to find out what's going on. Um, as I say, I need to be more careful with my freedom passes, but unfortunately pickpockets like London Underground. Um, I just thought I'd tell you about this because it might be a useful piece of advice for you. And once my pass comes through, you'll be seeing me start to put more train and bus videos out again as I travel around. I've got a few interesting little plans for you, so keep watching and you'll um, start to see some more videos in the next week or two. Bye for now. Thank you.